Piers Morgan, 62, said he has remained resilient despite the loss of his father at a young age, as he went on to make a dig at those who play the victim. The TV host famously left his post on Good Morning Britain after he refused to believe Meghan Markle's comments about her mental health as a senior royal. Piers was raised by his stepdad, Glenn Pugh Morgan, after his mother Gabrielle remarried after the presenter's biological father died. The star said he doesn't like to talk about the experience and prefers to remain resilient when facing adversity. He said, I think we need to get back to a place where we instill in people a stronger streak of resilience to deal with what life throws at you. Life is tough. My father died when I was one, I wouldn't say I never talk about it I do talk about it but I don't go into any great detail. I'm certainly not going to sit here and play the victim. I'm certainly an advocate for talking about resilience, it's one of the main topics that we discuss on Big Fisher Opinion on Success which I'd like to come on to later but also resilience and how you work through tough times to grow and become the person you are," Spencer replied. The talk TV host revealed he counts to 10 when he finds himself in challenging situations, despite walking off Good Morning Britain back in 2021 after rowing with his colleague Alex Pires for Dover remarks made about Meghan. In the Big Fish podcast comment section on Instagram, fans shared their division over remarks made by the broadcaster. Son Hornigold commented, in this short clip he far too closely puts mental health with playing the victim. Undeedy one SD added, yet he's on a personal mission to cancel Meghan Markle and now Harry. He walks off his own show when he is directly challenged but wants to be free to spew hate on others. Hashtag make it make sense. Nikki Zohasker said, but resilience isn't about not having mental illness, mental illness puts people at a disadvantage to those who don't suffer from it so putting everyone in the same bracket is not appropriate. While other followers praised him for his sentiment on the importance of staying strong in life. Don't miss cat.de.522 remarked, healthy wording. I like it. Resilience is so important in life. I agree with him. Will underscore Hall stated, couldn't put it any better than that. Reframe the conversation to help people rather than enable people. It comes as he also expressed his relief that he never apologized to Prince Harry and Meghan when he claimed one was demanded. The TV personality, 57 has been an outspoken critic of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex following their explosive interview with Oprah Winfrey in March 2021. During an installment of his uncensored show, Piers defended Jeremy Clarkson's apology to the Sussexes after his latest column in The Sun was met with intense backlash. In his opening monologue, he questioned, why should the royal family apologize when you consider what's happened to Jeremy Clarkson? He wrote, what he's admitted was a stupid and inflammatory newspaper column that overstepped the mark. The outrage was predictable and it was frankly justified, as he now concedes, 